So today I'm doing some work here on my golf cart. First of all, as you can see, I don't have a seat on here. Well, that was the seat. This is the foam piece, and this was a piece of metal underneath it, and there's supposed to be a piece of wood, but that rotted out. And that's your cover on the top. So the problem is my exhaust is right here, and I should have been smart and made the exhaust kind of run a different direction. So what happens is this gets really hot, and it was burning the piece of wood that the seat was on. And the exhaust just aims and hits the front of this uh, fiberglass body. So I got a new exhaust I'm going to put on seat and it's also not running right something's going on here i think the carbs either clogged up or i got something in the tank or uh, i'm gonna pull that apart and uh, clean it all out so the original motor on this blew up the uh, club car motor so what i got is a 420 cc predator motor straight from harbor freight i wanted this one because it's got a lot more power than the six and a half they had and then this one had the electric start too so it's been a pretty good motor so far i've had about five years in this car it's pretty simple just to throw a motor in one of these That's not good. Wow, there's water in that exhaust. Well, we got water down on the motor. Well, don't leave these motors out in the weather, I guess. Here's the new exhaust I got. Let's see if this flange fits on here first. The other problem is it's supposed to go this way. And it's not gonna fit. Which I don't want the exhaust to go this way anyway. This way. Because I don't think that's going to hit the body, and I always leave the top of this open. Granted, you probably shouldn't have it aiming at the gas tank, but I don't see why that would make any difference other than a hot exhaust being here. I'm going to put the shell back on and see where this lines up. So I think that should be okay. I'm going to have my seat up here, obviously, and that's a lot farther away than the seat was before from the exhaust. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it like that and I'll, I'll modify it if I have to at some point. Now, this broke off right here, this vent, which probably doesn't help this. I'm just gonna rip this off then. to pull this motor to get that off. I got it, wow. Oh boy, I'm about to lose some gas here. Oh no! 
God damn it. Son of a bitch. break. So that exhaust kit came with new jets for the carburetor. It was kind of like an aftermarket upgrade, I guess. Hopefully I don't regret this, but I'm gonna try and get that out. So I'm not seeing any difference between these. So rather than run the risk of it not working, I'm just gonna put this original one back in. So I'm gonna drain the oil on this, but I gotta jack it up because I can't get uh, my oil pan underneath there I have. filter. Hopefully that came with new flange bolts. Because otherwise that's not going to work. Alright, I got some new bolts here. All right, put some oversized nuts on there, so that should hold that okay. All right, I'm just gonna throw some gas in this and uh, fire it up, see what we got. That's running pretty good. I'm just gonna top it off with some more gas. Just gonna put the cover back on the air filter and then I'll check the oil one more time and 
We can work on the seat. So these golf carts have clips for these seats to hold them in. You can tell the original ones were here and down on that other side and they broke off. So what I'm going to do is put some new ones in. So I'll screw these down and then the seat sits on here. So all you do is you clip it down and in and it, the seat holds on that way. So One more thing I want to do to this. I have a backrest that I just kind of had laying around. Although that seems kind of short, but I figure I had it off a spare card, I might as well just put it on since I have it. I'm gonna say this project's done for now. Pretty happy with the seat. It seems to be running all right. It's kind of sputtering though. I don't know, it's like it's not getting good fuel or maybe I gotta run it around for a bit, I don't know. It hasn't run in a while. But it's okay the way it is. I don't really run it a ton. I just kind of use it to do the chores and take care of these guys, so. Certainly is a lot louder though. <laughs>